Hi guys, I uh, just want to talk about credit cards and stopping automatic payments and reactivations and things like that. Because sometimes you get these <coughs> payments you've done, not only for yourself, but maybe you do it for somebody else. For example, say uh, somebody doesn't have a credit card, <coughs> so you sign up for their credit card at their initial internet. Once their internet's activated, because they just want a credit card on the system. You then forget about it. You know, they give you the money and that's all done and dusted. The problem is when you've given that credit card, they've got it in the system and they're going to keep it. So if there's problems with the internet billing of the person that you helped, they will take it from your credit card, even though they shouldn't do. Um, also, you can get caught out when buying into something that's overpriced or something. There's lots of reasons for these credit card issues. But the quickest and easiest way of doing it, because the companies already know that they, the difference between a debit and a credit card is, debit's got to have it in your account. Credit card is a guarantee of cash off you. It's a guarantee that you will pay it, regardless if you've got money or not. They will withdraw it. Easiest way, just cut the card in half, throw it in a bin, and cancel everything. Uh, just tell them, turn around and say, call the company up and says. I've lost my card, deactivate, blah, blah, blah. And they'll give you a new number and a new card. They don't have the new details. And the reason I'm saying this is somebody got stuck with this recently. And I, as soon as I said to them, just cut your card up, the company will change its mood as soon as they can't get the money. Because they're just like, well, tough. We've got your details, da, da, da. They're in our system. You must pay this. And it's like, but it's not my bill. It's nothing to do with me. You must pay this. So all they did said, look, just cut it in half, phone the company up, say it's been stolen, whatever. They were sending you a new card, it's new numbers, etc. They can't use it. It's gone. And they could, the company could phone you up, but at the end of the day, it wasn't your debt in the first place. What are they going to phone you for? The only reason they want it is because it's, it's got your money on it. They can get your money because they're struggling to get it off the person who can't afford to pay the bill or for whatever reason is in dispute with them. Because that's another thing. If somebody says, I'm not paying you anymore because you're not providing this, whatever, with your credit card, they can still take it. But with the, the debit side, they can get it pulled back from the bank, they can turn around and cancel the standing order, etc. But with the credit card, it's more of a guarantee. So bear that in mind. And I'll do, I'm just putting this on there as one of the financial bits of information. I just thought about it this morning. All right, thanks for watching.